Vietnam-linked Irish group faces trial in France for rhino horn smuggling. On Monday, nine accused international rhino horn and ivory smugglers went on trial in France. After a random police traffic check along the highway in September 2015, French public prosecutors began their investigation, leading to the finding of numerous elephant tusks and 32.800 euros $38.900 in cash at BMW. The car's passengers, who claimed to be antique merchants, were reportedly Rathgael Rovers members, an Irish criminal organization with origins in the traveler community. The nine defendants on trial in Rennes, including suspected Chinese and Vietnamese merchants, face up to 10 years in prison and large penalties, although two of them are on the run. French authorities have found that ivory and rhino horns are converted into powder, flakes, and other items on French soils before being transported as a traditional medicine to Vietnam and China. A roughly 15-kilogram horn was found during the inquiry, which, according to environmental organization Robin des Bois, would have generated approximately $15 million, 13 million euros, if processed at Asian market rates at the time. Additionally, about 40 elephant tusks were found. The trial observer, Robin des Bois, said that auction houses had aided the sale of tusks to Vietnam and China in the French cities of Cannes, Toulouse, and Le Puy. Before smuggling, negotiating, and swindling, there is poaching with its atrocities, the organization said in a statement. As well as supporting the extinction of species, wildlife trafficking fuels corruption promotes speculative investment in ivory and rhino horn, and causes poaching. The Rathgael rovers were the subject of a combined investigation by European police in 2010 that resulted in the arrest of 31 individuals, including those suspected of rhino horn theft, according to the Europol Police Agency's website.